aka Saku Food, and I'm here with Casey from Casey Nom Nom. And we are here at Chino's Hot Chicken in Chino. <laughs> we have their chicken sandwich, and it's at their spicy, like their, they got their like red, like their spicy, like yeah. their high spicy level. And then they gave us the chicken tenders too. With a medium spice. Yeah, with a medium spice, because <laughs> let me tell you what happened earlier. So the owner, his name is Mike. I asked um, one of the employees named Maria, I was like, so how, how spicy are we talking here? And then she was like, hmm. And then Mike was like, oh, let me show you. He brings out first like the reg like the spicy. So that's like already high, so it's higher than medium. And then he brings out like the extra spicy. And then like, we both were like, we got it. But we tried like the spicy and we're like, it wasn't that bad. And then like I swallowed and then I was like, okay, it kind of hit a little bit. And then the extra spicy was so hot. We were literally dying. I was crying. She was like, I can't breathe. Yeah. That was so bad. Like, it was literally our first time here and they just see us like melting down. Don't get me started on the, on the beetle bug. <laughs> Maybe the tender. Okay, let's try the tender. I think he gave us like one spicy, spicy one, like the extra yeah. spicy one. Wait, no, I thought you. Oh, I'm sorry, one hot, hot and, and then, then one medium. Okay, okay, cool, cool. Which I think this is the hot one. Like, yeah, you said. that one with the more orange <laughs> tint. <laughs> Which one do you want to try first? Let's do the hot. Well, actually, let's do the medium. <laughs> so at least we remember it. <laughs> both were able to handle like yeah. the, this, the hot one but not the extra spicy one yeah Cause that like that killed me <laughs> yeah like she tried the extra spicy and then she started dying and i was like oh, yeah, yeah she, she got the heads up first before me oh actually this kind of already looks spicy <laughs> 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 chicken is like yeah. and it's like juicy too yeah they look like they use real meat <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> like this is the one that i probably would like get from the grocery store like yeah. not not the pre-packaged one but like the chicken itself yeah okay let's try it it's pretty good yeah this one's a juicy mm -hmm. a juicy chicken it's really tender and it's like lean <laughs> yeah when i ate when i took my first bite though all the spice so like hit my, lip, hit my lip and then the inside was the chicken <laughs> we'll try it with the sauce though and see like if this is like different mm. Mm. that was good that was probably like thousand islands yeah that's what i was thinking too yeah. not bad i like it mm -hmm. i like the flavor of the spices yeah and it's pretty it's pretty thick i was surprised that <laughs> We'll take oh, this one. <laughs> that is hot. We have this me like being confident, like I could take the hot one, because compared to the hot, the extra one, no. Okay, this is not bad. I like it. Mmm. The meat is actually really thick. Mm hmm Because they only gave us, they actually only just gave us two pieces, but this is like a lot. Mm hmm This is probably like five different chicken tender or like chicken nuggets. <laughs> But put together, I can sense that I'm crying a little bit though. <laughs> As a breast, it's really juicy. Mm -hmm. Cause you know, like breast tip, like usually overcooked. Yeah, it's like super dry. That's true. Even like the breading is like, cause I I would have imagined that the crust would have been like really burned or something. Yeah. You know, you know what I mean? Cause like I think sometimes when people bread chicken and stuff or just meat in general, mm -hmm. sometimes it doesn't like mesh within like the chicken itself. Yeah. Like, this is sometimes when I eat katsu. Like you know how like katsu sometimes it just looks like they put a sheet. Yeah. Yeah. So like and it lifts up. Yeah, it lifts up. Yeah. Like they're literally the crust <laughs> separates from the meat, but it's not like with this one. But mm -hmm. even though you would expect it maybe with like a regular, because they use like chicken breast too. Yeah. For like katsu and stuff. <laughs> okay. It looks I'm pretty, even more red. I'm pretty sure, like, this is so <laughs> like, it's like, it's it looks like, so red. It's so red. I know. 
Okay, what do you have to say to <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't lick my lips. <laughs> is it just me or is it this this one like even juicier than the first one? I think this one's like the better one. Mm. Oh, I feel it. Man. <laughs> my lip. Yeah. I can't feel it. <laughs> I think that one should be better because it has the full saw to like tone it. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's like eat, sip, and sniffle. <laughs> so, <laughs> when did you like start your food blog and like why did you start your food blog? I think I started it around two years ago because I always go out to eat and I like live locally, mm -hmm. which has like a lot of good food. My area is like spaced out, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Do you come down to the OC more? No, I don't, because it's kind of a far drive for me. It's like 45 to an hour yeah. away. What do you usually get like out here? Like what, what do you usually like look out for? I really like like Asian food since I'm like I grew up as American born Chinese. Mm -hmm. So I'm more accustomed to like Chinese food. Mm -hmm. And that's like what my parents would always like take me out to or like my mom would cook me mm -hmm. like dishes that she would eat in Hong Kong. Mm -hmm. So like I'm not too big of a fan on like American breakfast. Yeah. So I like <laughs> to go to like a lot more Asian restaurants around here. Yeah. And like if it's new then like obviously I'll go try it out. Mm -hmm. To see like is With it the hype. <laughs> Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like is it as good as like the six two six area which is like heavily populated with like so many different Chinese restaurants, yeah. like, other Asian restaurants as well. Mm -hmm. I feel like there's so many options here. Mm -hmm. like, Casey's right, like how the OC is so saturated. Like yeah. you probably see like 10 different boba shops in the same street. I forgot to mention this, but we, we started eating like the waffle cut fries that they have. Mm -hmm. It's kind of nice. Yeah. <laughs> Good crunchy nut spice. <laughs> yeah. Should we try like the mac and cheese? Yeah. I feel like mac and cheese is a good like side option for mm -hmm. spicy stuff too. Yeah. The cheese kind of. Well, I took too much. <laughs> mm. Oh, it's like kind of buttery. Wait, this is cheddar. I think mozzarella. it is. Yeah, so like cheddar cheese is usually like a really yeah. strong tasting thing to me. But then when you mix it with milk, it kind of mm. like mellows it out. Yeah, much more creamy. I think it like kind of melts in your mouth as well. Yeah, yeah. And I think that like the, the noodles themselves are mm. pretty soft. So that means that they boiled it nicely. Yeah. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> but I don't know like my, all my cheeses. I don't know all my cheeses either, but like I'm trying to learn. But then I'm also kind of lactose. Yeah. I think. I think. <laughs> I'm so lactose. I'm, I can tell that I'm slowly becoming lactose. It's really bad. Cause like sometimes when I get boba, if they have their freaking cheese foam on top, oh. I'm just like, <laughs> <It's> like bye. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, a lot of people are doing like alternatives. Yeah. I like oat milk. Oh, oat milk yeah. is good. Have you ever seen like oat milk boba yet though? No, I haven't. Like, that they own, like primarily use oat milk? Mm-hmm. Mm -mm. Yeah, I don't think I've seen any. That would be a good option, hey, whoever is like, <laughs> oh, watching. watching. <laughs> you want to try this? Just yeah. to like try it in the heck and then we can like <laughs> mix and match. So this is what it looks like. Oh wow, it has a spotlight. <laughs> <laughs> I really want to just dip it because I know it's hot. <laughs> Mine is a nice orange. Yours is <laughs> like red. red. Literally, it's the <laughs> table. Like, what the heck? I think they're using a potato bun. How do you know it's a potato bun? Um, like the color of it. Oh! Yeah. How do they make potato buns? They just like smash a potato and put it back together. <laughs> regular like meat bun or like white bun mm -hmm. it's like typically just like white but it's like actually yellow I think they also for this one they put like a barbecue sauce on it too or like their mm -hmm. thousand island sauce because yeah. I saw them drizzle like this red this orange brownish <laughs> sauce and then they have like the thousand islands on top oh no I feel it now mine is <laughs> <laughs>
I like their like barbecue sauce thing. Mm-hmm. It's actually a bit sweet. Mm -hmm. The hint of sweet that I can taste out of all the spice. <laughs> Good thing there's a freaking share, share tea. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Did you know how like when you eat like, oh, yeah. milk? Milk and sugar cuts spice because actually water just spreads it around. Yeah. <laughs> Which is probably why we were like dying yeah. for 10 minutes. <laughs> Yours looks like the extra spicy. Like, <laughs> what happens if they like just finesse us? And like, we'll give these girls like spicy, but we'll give them the extra. I wonder if they can take it. If we eat this every single day, mm -hmm. if we would get immune. I think we could. Eventually, I'll stop crying. <laughs> so, like, how did we meet? Food vlog. Yeah. It's a small world. Yeah. We had like a lot of mutual friends. And we're kind of like the same, like, age. Same age, kind of like the same California school <laughs> system. Yep. Same clubs, too. Yeah. <laughs> Basically, but we're just like a carbon copy of each other from a yeah. different school. But I think we're like roughly the same. You're taller than me, but like, still. Like, <laughs> I feel like I'm usually like the shortest and like. Oh, yeah, no, I'm high key the shortest. <laughs> like, how tall are you? I'm five. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I can't even think straight because like the water is like just so watery in my left eye. Yeah, like if you could see, she's actually watering. <laughs> what would you rate this like meal? Aside from when I was dying from the <laughs> spice, mm -hmm. like how juicy and big the portions were, like for the tenders and like this, I feel like this is actually a pretty good size. Yeah. Even though it's cut in half, I would rate it like a nine, maybe just Next time I come, like, we'll go medium. We'll down for a medium. <laughs> I agree. And, like, I appreciate when they have really quality, like, chicken. Yeah. Because I can tell when a chicken's not a real chicken. <laughs> yes. but... yeah. Oh, no! It's <laughs> I can't. I mean, oh, my God. Dude, what the heck? I don't even know no. what to do. No, I, <laughs> I swear. It's <laughs> I saw it going towards us, and I just like, I don't even want to look at him. Maybe it's who will recognize me. It will recognize me. I don't want him to remember me. All right, thank you guys so much for watching at Psycho Food and Casey Nom Nom. And I just want to give a huge shout out to Chino's Hot Chicken for inviting us here because you guys literally are so insane and I love your chicken because it's so like fiery hot and we, we just literally have like a blast here. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys soon. Bye. Bye. <laughs>